Huge congratulations to Nicki Minaj and the Barb's Super Bass is finally certified diamond officially. The plaque from the RIA, the whole deal. It's real. After years of being bombarded by the Barb's on Twitter, uh, asking me to certify the record, uh, it finally happened. I mean, me personally, I couldn't certify it. I just don't have the power to do that. But Nicki and the label finally did it. Uh, it's truly such a huge accomplishment because she's now the first female rapper to have a certified diamond record and the first black solo artist uh, female to have a certified diamond record. And I mean, if that's not a huge accomplishment in itself, I don't know what to say. I mean, she has done so much for the music industry. She has changed the game. The whole reason why even streaming counts towards charting now uh, is because she vocal vocalized that. She she was one of the first people to say like, hey, this needs to count towards album sales, single sales. And a lot of people piggybacked along on those comments. And the crazy thing is that Super Bass was done before that even happened. So she had a diamond record because it's been diamond for a few years and she, she just, it just wasn't certified yet. But the fact that she would make that point and help other future artists uh, with the album sales, uh, by counting the streaming numbers, it's just a testament to her vision as an artist and just the selflessness she has as an artist. And often, you know, things get, you know, thrown out of whack by these clickbait headlines out there. I and mean, we don't need to go through it all. But there's a lot out there that gets uh, that overshadows, you know, what she brings to the table and continues to bring to the table and brought to the table. Um, and unfortunately, like, you have, like, guys like Piers Morgan going after her for nonsense. Uh, it's funny she actually even, that's, that's her Twitter, Twitter bio right now, the rudest little madam. But, you know, stuff like that happens, and, you know, I guess she's making light of it. It's funny, but, you know, it overshadows what she actually did and continues to do in terms of just being an iconic hip-hop artist, an iconic artist in general. Um, and I think this goes to show that if it wasn't already the case and you know the crazy thing is this record wasn't even supposed to be on the album or even as big as it was it was kind of just a throwaway they threw on there see what it does and i think you know i remember taylor swift you know being on a radio station rapping the song and after that it just blew up so much it was already gaining some steam but after taylor swift started rapping the lyrics, it really just blew up. And she actually thanked Taylor Swift in uh, her video. I mean, that she posted on Instagram. She thanks her in the caption. So, um, yeah, the record just turned out to be a monster. It's one of my favorite songs. It's one of the biggest songs in music history, obviously. And uh, it's just well-deserved all around. So congrats once again to everyone who, to Nikki, everyone who worked on the album. Just one of the most iconic songs in hip-hop history. Congrats.